little uh, trailer that I can tow behind my Yamaha Rhino, my truck, or my Honda Civic for camping. Just under 600 pounds, dry weight. It's got the propane for the buddy heater inside and for the uh, barbecue that Coleman stove that sits on the little table as well. And lots of LED lighting inside and out. Little redwood cedar tree decoration just for for fun. And we got a big handle here that's a piece of driftwood. It's all homemade. Little magnet that holds the door open. Little window open the door. This is a uh, homemade screen door. Six feet long by four feet wide, just enough for two people. A buddy heater. It's got a fan up top. Two sliding windows on the side. This one as well. Redwood cedar trim around the windows. Windows um, in the front and the door are made out of a polycarbonate, tinted polycarbonate. This is my custom little redwood cedar cupboard for clothes. Just enough space for a weekend. And that's the his. This is the hers. Same thing. We got a 800 watt inverter there to uh, charge the uh, the cell phones. LED lighting outside. This little button right here lights up this LED bar inside, and it swivels so I can shine it inside and out. And then I got LED lighting for reading up there as well. And then the whole thing is uh, on a uh, trailer that opens up in the back. Better look at that. That's where the RV steps come out. That hook onto that bar there, so it's perfect to get in and out. And all our camping stuff is stored in here. All the usual stuff. Yeah, it's my little trailer. I really like it because it's under 600 pounds, so you can tow it with anything. Especially the Yamaha Rhino. It makes it nice. This is a little clip-on table that I just finished building to uh, do cooking on. Of course we had to do a checker plate because that's just cool. And I just used a, a normal RV hinge table leg adjustable. I had to screw about three more holes in there just to make it longer. Put a couple uh, old IKEA handles that I've been hanging on to for quite a while. That was just for uh, for towels to hang and dry. And then I put a bent a couple hooks here for uh, whatever tools you want for cooking brush to scrub the barbecue whatever you want and then uh, we've got LED lighting on both sides out here which uh, is controlled by the back or inside so if you hear a noise at night you can flick on the switch and it lights up this whole place and I got a canvas tarp system that hooks in to this point right here and then the, a point in the back as well and then 
the eyelets just hook into here and then these things just screw right over top of that and just hold the canvas very taunt along the whole um, the whole camper here and that gives uh, shelter just a small canvas uh, eight by six but it's awesome for, uh, for having that shelter and then I just have adjustable pegs that go out and hold it up so there it is that's my little pod full aluminum roof and I rolled the aluminum around all the edges and obviously did trim and I also did uh, an inverted trim um, to have a gutter system so all the rain just runs right off alright guys maybe I'll do another video later anything I add to it but there you go there she is <laughs>